kazi ni miongoni mwa changamoto kuu zinazo likumba taifa hali hii ikichangia kuanzishwa kwa miradi utakaowasaidia vijana kuanzisha na kupanua biashara zao mwiaki njogu na mengi zaidi Serikali ya Kenya juzi imejitahidi katika kuweka mikakati kabambe ili kupambana na ukosefu wa ajira na ikiwa ni mwezi moja tu tangu bajeti ya mwaka 2019-2020 kusomwa maswala ibuka ni wapo biashara ndogo ndogo zitafaidika kifedha kabla mwaka huu wa kifedha kukamilika Utafiti uliofanywa na shirika la kuhesabu na kurekodi data KNBS unaonyesha kuwa vijana wanachangia asilimia ishirini ya watu nchini huku asilimia sabini ya vijana hawa wakikosa ajira. Kando na hayo kati ya kila vijana tano waliohitimu moja tu ndio hubahatika kupata ajira. Ili kupambana na hali hii, serikali ya Kenya pamoja na Benki Kuu ya Dunia imezindua mashindano almaarufu mbele na biz ili kuwapa vijana fursa ya kuwasilisha mipango yao ya biashara kwa minajili ya kutathminiwa kabla ya kufadhiliwa. Carlos Felipe, mkurugenzi mkuu wa Benki ya Dunia katika mataifa ya Kenya, Rwanda, Uganda pamoja na Somalia, ana imani kuwa vijana wanaonuia kuanzisha biashara na kuyashinda mashindano haya watapata usaidizi wa kifedha. And this program that uh, we launched today the, uh, through the Kenya Youth Employment and Opportunities Project is I think one of our most important initiatives in this space. It's a 150 million dollar multi-sectoral project whose design recognizes that youth face multiple constraints in finding employment and also launching business ideas. Margaret Kobia, katibu katika wizara ya utumishi wa umma, vijana na jinsia, ameorodhesha ukosefu wa fedha kama changamoto kuu inayowakumba vijana wanaotaka kuanzisha biashara. So today is such one day when we have an opportunity where youth can be able to participate and use their energy, their resilience, their determination to write a business plan. And not just write a business plan, write a business plan that is winning so that you can be able to be funded. Peter Munya, katibu katika wizara viwanda na biashara, mapema hii leo alizindua shindano hili la mbele na biz na kusema kuwa zaidi ya vikundi 750 vya vijana watakaoibuka washindi vitapata usaidizi wa takriban laki tisa ama milioni tatu na laki sita kwa minajili ya kuanzisha biashara and the mondo is basically to have them compete so that you get the very best because we don't have enough resources to to give everyone so that's why it is packaged in terms of a competition so that the best ideas and the best business proposals win and then after that there is of course the incubation and the support that they will receive when they start the implementation of those ideas wingu la ofisadi limeikumba taifa hili mara si haba aidha vijana wana matumaini kwamba mashindano haya yatakuwa ya haki na kweli ili kuwapa fursa ya kupanua na kuanzisha biashara zao mwihaki njogu KUTV Nairobi